Do you have to do that every goddamn time? <laughs> I haven't done it in like 10 episodes. Calm the fuck down. No! Oh, right, they're here. Okay, I'll calm down. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play the MJ's Let's Play of Metroid Prime. This is your host, the MJ4106. And Code 9001. Yep. And we're finally heading down to get our next upgrade after grinding for some more items for, like, two episodes. Which is too many for my taste! Which, I think I got everything around this area, so now we're gonna... Yeah, you guys remember this room where I got an energy tank? Well, the room after this tunnel. So I forgot about the tunnel. So I'm an idiot. Yep, see? Spiderball track! Let's go up it now! Yay! Yep. And now we found another white door. Oh, look at that. A plated parasite. How awesome. Oh, God, more beetles. Yes. If you're wondering how to get up to that spiderball track, stay tuned. Because this scan over here for the Bendesium, that'll be important later in the game. Yes. Ah, shows a lore. Yep. Prepare. There's going to be a lot of lore coming up. Now we're in an ominous place where it looks abandoned. Well, oh wait, we're in a place of ruin. How is it not abandoned? What the hell am I talking about? Yeah, I was about to say. Let's get these shows of lore. Okay. Totally, dude, look at me go, man. Oh, man. Totally know how to ride that pipe, man. Yep. Oh, hang on a second. Almost forgot this missile expansion over here. Yep. Gotta look out for symbols like that, because usually there's something hidden behind that you'll need to fire a super missile at for. Yep. Yep. Aw, oh, man. I hate these puzzles. I hate trying to get up high, though. There we go. Yep, and you can drop more ball bombs while on the spider-ball track, because you'll need that to distract your, um... I want to say ride. But it's not really a ride, it's more of a crawl. It's a crawl in your ball. Yes. Spider-ball! Coming to toy stores! Never! Oh. Alright. Alright, can you hang on a minute? I have to talk to someone real quick. Yep, you go for that. Alright, be right back. Me and my viewers will enjoy me going up this ramp again. Okay, I think we have to deal with this. Which is nothing. Let's see here. Oh god, more scarabs. Oh man. Like, the weird thing about this game, the middle of the game is like the most boring part. Because that's where like, I don't know, a lot of the interesting stuff doesn't happen. A lot of the good power-ups come in, but you don't do a lot of interesting things. It's kind of disappointing, but... Don't worry, this stuff's still fun. Oh god, it's another one of these motherfuckers. Another Shozo ghost. Great. Yeah, you see how they keep disappearing like that? There's a way to stop them from doing that, but I can't do that yet, so... Yeah, don't worry. These guys will get a lot easier later in the game. But for now, you deal with them disappearing and everything. Let's get this lore as he disappears. Hmm. The statue's hands are lighting up. Perhaps we should go in there. Oh my god, it's alive! Oh god, he's bowling me! Conveniently up to the here, where I can... Oh! Three more, more ball bomb slots? Lovely. Okay. Guess it's time for us to... Oh hey, another hole. Oh yes, I never mentioned these, because this is something completely new, that there have only like three of in this game. It's a missile station. 
If you have no idea what it does, well, I need to learn to read or stop being an idiot. There we go. Now I'm full of missiles, even though I almost was full of missiles, we can go back. I have to guess by the color of the beam that that's what deactivates this. Yep. The color beam deactivates the force field, so let's go in and... What's happening? Oh! Hey, the thing down there is changing. Oh god, is this turning into a science experiment? Samus was already born off science experiments, which... Oh yes! Here's a little interesting note. Apparently Samus has, like, uh, bird genes in her. Because the way she was uh, brought about her life, she uh, was taken and raised by the Shozo originally. The, uh, I guess they're, I guess the easiest way for me to put them, they're like bird people. And that's why she's like super athletic and all that crap. She's, they're the main reason basically. Now, I think they gave her the power suit to get through the environments. I don't remember for sure. I have to re-look up that history stuff. Okay, I am back. Ah, great timing. We're about to drain this pool of water. Uh, we have to refill it in my own urine. Uh, Thankfully, we don't, actually. Okay. Yeah, that would have been, been very disappointing. Oh, god damn it! Yep, now we got rid of the water, we can actually use this half pipe. Thank you, Stone Toad! When, while you think you're trying to kill me, you're actually helping me. Let's get in this door and... Oh, lo and behold! It's the Ice Beam! And yeah, your next part is up! Ice, ice, baby! The Ice Beam has been acquired. So go to plus and go to the third one over here. I think he used a C stick to uh, change beam weapons in GameCube. I don't remember anymore. Okay, you're not gonna believe what the next section you're gonna go to. What the author of the uh, author I'm using decided to call the section. Oh God, I have a feeling I'm not looking forward to the title. Uh, yeah. Okay, have you ever seen or at least heard of the? Broadway musical, uh, Wicked. Yes, I have. Okay, there's a song in there that that this guy used as the title. Uh-oh. And it's a very popular song for that musical, too. Well, I'm not going to title my episode that if that's what you're trying to get to. No! I'm not a big fan of musicals. Sorry, people, I'm just not a fan. Okay, okay, well, I guess there's no harm in telling you that there's a Spider-Man musical. Well, I knew about that. Oh, they actually, supposedly they improved on it. Oh, yeah, I, I, I knew about it after they uh, made fun of it on South Park. Oh, God. You seen that episode? Probably not. No, no. I've been out of the South Park loop for about a couple years now. Yeah. Basically since I started college is when I was out of the South Park loop. Damn, they've had some good episodes this season, believe it or not. Like, South Park's been doing well recently. Oh shit, I can't do anything in here. Why did I even come here? God damn it. Well, it lengthens the episode, I guess, for more commentary. Yeah, like, like you need to watch more of the recent South Park stuff. Like, last season was actually pretty good. They finally found their funny bone again, I guess you could say? Yeah. Like, oh my, the season finale? Oh my god, it was hilarious. By the way, are you still recording? Yes, I am. We are going back to where I just was, because I went the wrong way. You dumbass. Well, I could, I could technically get a power up, but I think everyone'd be really confused unless they played through the whole game before. So I'm gonna wait on it and do it the right way. Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Let me hurry up and activate this. 
Because now I have to battle another Shozo ghost. God damn it, I hate battling these things. Oh! Never mind, three of them! And fucking fantastic. Yeah, go ahead. Let the commentary go, because I'm going to be battling these guys for a few minutes. Yeah. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, like, what was I talking? Oh, yeah. South Park, that's right. Um, last well, season was actually pretty funny. They had one that was, um, based on musicals, and it was, oh my god, it was hilarious. Like, they made fun of the Wicked musical, they made fun of the Spider-Man musical, they made fun of, Gre um, I don't know, they made fun of Grease. I don't remember, I haven't seen it in a while, but it's actually a good episode. Like, I would, I would say some things, but, alright, yeah, I would say some things, but I don't want to spoil it for you guys if you haven't seen it. And by the way, if you're offended by South Park, I can understand your view of that, but come on. South Park makes fun of everybody. If you think they're singling you out, they're not. They make fun of, they make fun of Asians, they make fun of blacks, they make fun of whites, they make fun of women, they make fun of men, they make fun of midgets. They make fun of friggin', they make fun of, they make fun of really challenged people. <laughs> Like derogatory uh, groups you can think of, they make fun of. Oh yeah, exactly. Like if you find offense to South Park, then come on, grow some fucking balls. Like they make fun of everybody. That's why it's fair. Cause they're not singling anybody out. Although I will say they do make fun of Jews and Asians pretty often. <laughs> Sometimes they have it coming though. And no, and it's always good when they find the perfect time to make fun of pop culture things. Like, the election episodes have, the two or three election episodes they've had have all been pretty good. Particularly the last one, because, guess, oh wait, actually, it's not another guess when we record this, because the episode of the uh, most recent election episode, which was the season finale, the election just happened to be coming at the right time when Disney bought LucasArts. Ah, uh, yes. They got to make fun of that, and I will say, they did a very good job with that. They really did. I really like it. I still it. think one of my favorite episodes was the, the one where they made fun of the Joe's Brothers. That was pretty classic. Oh, that was a good one. And fucking Mickey Mouse beat the shit out of one of them. I know. I loved it. You don't talk to me oh, like that again. Oh. Oh. Imagine if he was like that hey, epic Mickey. By He's the like, way, uh, for those of you who have seen uh, um, Max or Double X Studios' video of um, MJ doing certain something. Oh, uh, right. I, I should post a link to that. I found someone who does a better voice than he did. Probably. In fact, it was like perfect. Well, yeah, it I almost sounded like the original pu puppeteer. Well, yeah, I'm sure mine wasn't perfect. Oh shit! Oh wow, I forgot to stop that save point. Oh well, well, we're in an elevator, so this is a decent point to stop, I guess. So yeah, we got the ice beam, and we um are going our way to the next one. So till next time, this has been your host, the MJ four hundred six. And go to FS on one special guest. Yep, and we'll see what's down this elevator next time. Later, folks.